Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Ho. Oh, H to the O V. I used to move snow. All right. Happy Monday. Welcome back to another episode of my news vlogs. Um. So this past weekend, uh, we were in Augensburg, something or other, New York. My parents came. First time seeing them in forever like 10 weeks um and we hauled it overnight back home got there got back to the shop around six in the morning and ready for another week so this week uh i thought so how far is going to mark mark is going to pennsylvania cheech and kurt are going to Texas, Corpus Christi, Texas, um, and I am staying back at the shop this weekend, and help Tim work on the motor, um, it's acting up, it's blowing smoke out of the right header, and if you know anything about motors, it's not supposed to do that, <laughs> um, so we're just gonna, not really chill, but we're gonna be working, work on the motor, clean the shop, we have the big Champaign, Illinois County Fair coming up, so we're gonna work on getting the trailers ready for that, make them nice and purdy, shine them up, because they either, one of the haulers is going on display. Um, so I'm gonna shine that up real good. Turn that some sideways! And just get ready for the fair. So without further ado, let's get the week started. <laughs> Today is Friday, and if most of you guys know, well, you should all know by now that um, last night <clears throat> Scott Hardzark passed away. Last night around 5 p.m., he passed away, and news broke this morning, and it's been a tough one for everyone in the launch truck industry. Um, not the news you want to wake up to, but if you ask a thousand Monster Truck fans or anyone, 999 of them would say that Scott Hartshock is the greatest driver to never win a world championship. A true legend, a, one of the greatest of all time, one of a childhood hero of mine growing up watching him i've always wanted to have the confidence he had going into an event in a race whether it's he was facing tom and goldberg dennis and gray digger lyle hancock and blue thunder he always had confidence and almost like a little bit of cockiness to him that i loved it was just the attitude i wanted to have and uh it's been kind of a quiet day here at the shop um tim tim hall and i this morning we were kind of just talking, uh, he was actually at Scott Hartzuck's first ever race he ever competed in. We just 
and told stories. Um, the story I have about Scott is 2019 Fox show, me, Matt, and Danny got to meet Scott. And I kid you not, he talked with us in a pit party for a good 10 minutes. And he had us laughing the entire time. He was a funny, funny man. And after like 10 minutes, the security guard came over. He was like, all right, hurry along. You still got people waiting in line. And Scott, he was like, no, no, no. I'm going to finish talking with these guys. And he like insisted on continuing the conversation we had. And he was a funny, funny man. And he was anyone you would want to have a conversation with. He was a great, great man. Um, he ended it. He was like, you guys want a picture? We're like, yeah. He was like, all right, one thing, put your guns up. So... But we were like, oh my god, this guy's a legend. We already knew that, but he became even more of a legend. Um, so, Scott, thank you for everyone. On behalf of everyone you've touched in the world in general, thank you. Thank you for being a childhood hero. One of the greatest of all time. The greatest to never win a world title. And just an amazing man. Scott. You'll be missed. Rest in peace. Alright, um... Today is Friday, flash forward. I know I haven't really vlogged uh, that much all week. Um, It was, it was a tough day. Uh, quiet day at the shop. Nothing really was said because it was hard. Um, this weekend, like I said earlier, I'm gonna stick him back, helping out with the engine, getting that torn apart, uh, fixed. And it was a quiet day at the shop. It was tough. It's been raining all day. Um, the sun is just coming out. And we're all still in disbelief of uh, what happened last night. So, it's tough. Hard to process it. Hard to accept it. But, Scott, you're going to be missed. So, this weekend, tomorrow, Saturday, we are still working on the motor and getting the shop cleaned up. Like I mentioned, getting the uh, haulers shined up, got on display for the Champaign County Fair, work on our ammunition, get that finished up, shining up. Uh, that's all I really got to say. I got Nader a surprise. You tell him a sh boy. Cause I can't fucking bother. Come here. I love you. Now hug me, brother! I love you, buddy. <laughs> Holy Alright, um... Today is Saturday. We are at the shop. I'm staying back uh, this weekend, helping out Tim with the motor. As you can see, working on it. We got the heart of the beast out. Heart's right there, working on it. Um, working on the pistons. Um, it's tough, because it's been quiet at the shop lately, and I can imagine it's been like that in every other monster truck shop throughout the nation because we're just still mourning the loss of our good friend Scott Hartsock. So it's tough because we lost a good one. And, but we're going to do it. We're going to do it in honor of him. This goes, and Scott would have wanted every team out there to keep kicking ass like everyone always does in honor of him because 
He'd want us to go out there, cock blocking Red Air Rock, just like Scott Hartsock only could do. So, fun chilling here on Saturday. Tomorrow I have off. Nader and I are probably going to hang out, do some, maybe some hunting for spin. Um, it's hard, I'm not going to lie, it's hard, but Scott would want the show to go on. So, we miss you, our friend. We miss you, Scott. Godspeed. All right, today is Saturday and we are back at the shop uh, working on the motor and lunch break right now. And yesterday I found the, his, uh, I surprised Nader earlier with the 50 pack. I'm gonna get some more customers if, if they have them. So, yeah. I'll take your entire stock. Hey, Mike. What's up? Do you remember this? <laughs> All right, today is Sunday. Um, it's, it's been a tough week, I'm not gonna lie. Um, anyone, probably everyone in the launch truck world had a tough week. Uh, so I also, I found out on Friday, Bismarck Key passed away as well. If you'd probably, he's probably my favorite one-hit wonder. Uh, probably one of the most popular one-hit wonders of all time. Uh, just a friend. You, you got what I need. Um, and of course, um, Scott Hartzak passed away. Um, it's tough. It's tough. Um, I know there's no crying in monster trucks, but oh god, it's tough. Um, have you watched the one of the two videos? The first video I told you my encounters with Scott, and god, that was a funny guy. He was you. You wish you could talk with him for hours on end. Um, there's a few other stories I'm not gonna say on here because I'm not keeping PG, but he was just a funny, funny guy. And a hero I looked up to growing up, just, it's not even, just a little bit of, co not even cockiness, but the cockiness, the confidence, the belief in himself. You couldn't help but be inspired by him to, have that confidence in yourself and he was the nicest guy in the entire industry he a pioneer for this industry a legend in this industry and it hasn't even set in that he's gone it hasn't set in and it's tough because well, half of it has set in like he's gone but Almost, he is. He was almost a guy that the way he drove and who he was, it almost feels like he was gonna live forever in a way. But Scott, we're gonna miss you, man. And rest in peace. Um, hug, hug your loved ones. If you have any beef, you have any drama, you have any issues with someone, just squash it. End it all. Hug your loved ones. Say I love you more. You, you don't know what time is going to be the last time. Okay. Life's short. Life's fragile. It all can end in a second. You don't know. It's Life's too tough, man. Life's short. Hug your loved one to live every moment like it's your last. Because you don't know when the Lord's gonna call you up. And you don't know when your time is. You don't know what time is gonna be the last time. So, so that about wraps it up for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, Michael, Kathy, the rest of the Heart Talk friends and family, we're all praying for you. Our condolences are with you. 
you have the entire monster community, every single person behind you and there for you. And I just pray, pray for you guys right now. And like I said, hug your loved ones. I'm gonna miss you, Scott. So now we're wrapping up this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Enjoy some peace and love. And I'll see you guys next week later.